what would Tyler Durden do? Dot com. Yeah. Kind of stealing our would you bit, I think. Would you? I know it's probably like one of those things a lot of people do, but yeah. I think we brought it to the forefront. Would you? The would you. We see a, a lovely lady or an ugly lady. Or a slob, or yeah. Or a slob on TV, and then we ask each other, would you? Would you? Well, on uh, WWTDD.com yesterday, oh. they had a picture of Helen Muir, and I would have to say yes. Dude. <laughs> Can we see her? I think I got a mommy issue. <laughs> I think I got a mommy <laughs> fetish issue. She has an ample bosom. She's got amazing. How old is she? She's an old broad. But she's got amazing. Dude, she's sexy. Man. <laughs> she's... You digging that, Jimmy? Not as much now, but she was in Caligula. She was fucking hot really? in Caligula. Are those, in? Yeah. Are those uh, natural or, oh, or she's yeah. got the big implants? Those are her fucking big natural British tits. Really? Wow, because yeah. uh, the nips seem pretty high up for an old broad like that. Oh, maybe she had them worked on them, but maybe she always she had, had big, lift. heavy boobs. Is maybe there, she had a lift. Is there a bit of a turn on there, Jimmy? Yeah, she's a little... She's, I saw this picture yesterday, and I got a little warm. <laughs> Did you get fuzz, a little fuzzy? A little, little warm. Yeah, she looks like Glenn Close a little bit. She looks pretty good. And she's got... Uh, they have to be at least at least D's, full D's, and, and the picture has a little nip uh, nip popping out. Not popping out, but nip... Uh, how yeah, do you, yeah. Popping it's, through the clothes, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. She is an old broad, though. She's got to be, I would say she's in her 60s. Yeah. I'm going to guess 63, 64. Maybe if I get no. her to dye the hair a little bit. I don't I don't think I could have sex with a, a woman with gray hair. That's my <laughs> line. Well, you know something? They don't dye down there, and they probably don't uh, shave either. She goes freaking new school. You think? Mm-hmm. Old broad like that? Oh, yeah. I don't, I don't know. Oh, yeah. A lot of people look at old broads. And say, wow, she's sexy, or oh my God. Because uh, you know who was uh, uh, on a commercial these days is Raquel Welch. She's on some kind of a, a sunglasses commercial. She used to get me going big time. Uh, well, that's like, sh- she's, she's no kid. I know. And it, it might look good on the outside with all the clothes on. But could you imagine what that looks like naked? Helen Mirren is 63 oh, Mirren, years old. Oh, right, Mirren. Very 63. Good, I think James said 63. That was a guess, yeah. Uh, you, once those clothes come off, it's got to be a fucking disaster. All hell breaks loose. All, all, uh, <laughs> all bloody hell. <laughs> I mean, I'm talking that alligator skin, fucking Have too ever... much sun freckle chest thing, and like <laughs> just saggy skin. But, and Have you ever been with a girl where... You take the clothes off and all hell breaks loose. All hell breaks loose. <laughs> this way. There's been uh, girls where there's been problems That's what after I mean. they take yeah. their clothes off. Not all hell breaking loose. <laughs> all hell. All break. hell. <laughs> Just, That's fucking. There's all, there's wow. Also, Is that her now? Yes. I'm telling you. All right. Hold on. She's got a pink. Jimmy, what about that picture? 63 year old Helen. Yeah, Helen Merrill is She's good, got a man. pink bikini on. Just. The, those boobs are begging to be free. She got like abs. She's got abs. Yeah. What's going on there? I'd bang Helen. I mean, I'm not big on older ladies. Like, but once they can vote, they should be thrown out. But I mean, she is fucking <laughs> sexy, man. What I'm happens? Sorry. She's what? got one of those like, but that hairdo. What happens to the face? Because from the neck down, uh, look at the from the neck down for real. And give me a real age, Amp. How old do you think that woman could, is? I've seen fucking pictures of chicks probably in their 30s with bodies like that. Except the underarm of the... Um, oh, yeah, the underarm's yeah. a little rough. That's but a problem. Besides that, that's a problem area. All right, all right. Now we're going a little lower. How, how old is that? <laughs> all right. And Danny's now gotten rid of the arms. We're slowly chopping her to pieces. <laughs> I would say that's a, a woman in her early... Late 30s, early 40s right yeah, there. Yeah, the body. That's it. But, and then you go up to the head. In good and, shape, too. You in know? good shape. And then the head makes it... Uh, look at that. Uh, look at that fucking... The, the bicep, under the bicep, though. The tricep area is just a fucking disaster. Mm-hmm. That's a lot of uh, hangy gravity shit, mm-hmm. and then the short gray hairdo is just uh, well, ain't ain't doing it. She should fucking dye that <laughs> hair and grow it long. Uh, how do you say your fucking name? Because this guy has has some good instant feedback. Psychotic, I guess, from Wagbag. Yeah, he writes, "I'd fuck her, but her bunt wrinkles. <laughs> it's got to hang down three inches." <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Bunt wrinkles. Vicky, Vicky LaMotta, uh, age 50 in Playboy. That's right. Uh, Dude, she was not... fucking amazing in Playboy. No, I didn't dig that yeah, in I didn't Playboy. That. She was wearing like a net thing, and it looked like it was holding together a world hurt. <laughs> I think there'd be a problem there. All hell would bust loose. Can we see her All hell breaks loose when you take your clothes off. <laughs>
That is funny, and man. I'm not even talking about like having, you know, bringing an old broad home. I'm talking about yeah. some of the young ones. Is you're like, what the fuck was this? Dude? There was there was a a, a girl uh, a girlfriend of mine years ago when I was in high school, and uh, you know you're getting all fucking worked up, ready to take the clothes off and and see her naked for the first time and shit. So the, the shirt comes off and the little the front one of those front little click bra things, and then I open up. And she was had to be 16 years old, and her nipples were pointing down. <laughs> oh, Danny just goes, oh, oh. I was like, what? what? All hell broke loose. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, 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 oh. I was like, okay, right for the pussy. <laughs> I, I, I need that clip. We need, uh, our, we need our old banks. Yes. Because the old banks had our uh, better clips on at uh, Iraq, if you're listening down the hall. Because I don't know, wah, I want to do the wah, 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 wah. but that's not on the uh, this version of the instant replays. <laughs> I, I, had, I had a girl once, <clears throat> the Jewish broad that the mom hated me because it wasn't Jewish. I've told that story a million times. In this day and age, <laughs> she had a she had a fine set, same thing. Yeah, I'm like, oh my god, I'm like <clears throat> just frothing. I'm like, this is gonna be just amazing. Yeah, and I undo the bra, and she had full. Full D's, easy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, she had innies, innie nips. Oh, yeah. And transparent. Have you come across the transparent nip yet? Transparent? Yeah. Where you see what? Veins and stuff? The, the or nip, you see her heart? <laughs> the nip is pretty much the same color as the rest of the breast. Oh, just about. yeah, it's yeah. That's slight, I mean, ever so slightly darker. She, um, it almost looks like there was no nip, which no made the thing areoli. look. Areoli? Very unusual. I'm trying to, yeah. Oh, it almost to... looked like it was a cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> trying to picture that. Where is really? it? Really? I do have it? Yeah, thanks. Uh, see, I, it's just somewhere else. See what's on there, though. Because okay. it'll probably be something else. Uh, which one was it? This one? <laughs> All right, good. Ah, there We're back in business. That's good. Now we can do a show. Back in business. <laughs> Thank goodness. So, Helen Mirren, <laughs> I say yes. Jimmy, would you? Yeah, yeah I'll add back Helen in a second. Yeah. And obviously not. No, no. I, I, well, yeah. Maybe she uh, had a great, great, great granddaughter. Great, great. It is bring your daughter to work day today. Found that out, too. Any prospects going to be brought in today, you think? You think they'll bring them past the old O&A show studios? <laughs> Why can't we? Uh, work? That's her? Who's that? Caligula, right? That's, that's Helen and Caligula, I think. I think that's Helen Caligula. Jesus. Wow, she's not even the same person. No. A fucking, a few, a few spins around the sun. I don't know if that's and, her. Uh, but... something happens to people. Uh, <laughs> Too many cricket. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we got it. <laughs> Big hefty tits. <laughs> we have to go to the phones. <laughs> oh, do we? Okay. Anthony on Long Island, go ahead. Yo, what's up, guys? Hey. I'm a big fan of doing the, uh, you know, opening the gift wrap. You pull it down, you never know what you're going to get. Yeah. Uh, man, I was in my early 20s, and so was she. You think she'd be fit? This bush was the <laughs> biggest thing I have ever seen. I shit you not, up to the belly button, down past the asshole. <laughs> past the, past I, the asshole. I swear to God. <laughs> Thank God uh, evolution's taking care of that. You look, at some, you look at some old playboys like, I don't think girls grow hair there anymore. Wow. I'm not talking about the the, yeah. the basic area either. That's um, another shot of Helen Mirren. Boy, there's plenty of shots of her with her shirt off. She's naked a lot. Yeah, she loves her big. There's a little lopsidedness breasts. going on there, though. Yeah, it's one's a always little a little bigger than yeah, the other. Cool. What's she doing underwater? <laughs> underwater, <Naked. laughs> she's underwater <laughs> naked. Wow. Uh, what's this, uh, Mr. Skin? Sure you is. get younger. Pi- oh, oh. oh, I see okay. a problem area, though. <laughs> oh. Is that a duty popping out? Or, or <laughs> I, I think there's some or hair. Bed, <laughs> or bed hair hygiene. Dude, you know how old those pictures are? So she's probably got the full blown bush. <laughs> Let's say hi to Matt in North Carolina. Helen Mirren, Mr. Skin, younger pictures, not so bad. Uh, no. What's up, Matt? How you guys doing? Good, Matt. Hey there, Matt. Uh, this uh, chick was hot, and um, I go take the bra off. I'm getting fancy with her, and uh, go to do a little licking on them, and they're hairier than uh, most guys uh, that I know. Oh. The oh. nipple itself, I was just, you know, it's almost like you're spitting out hairs after you're going down on her. But uh, oh. uh, it was it was sick, dude. Yeah, the chick. 
the chick with the uh, downward nips, yeah. also on one of her nips, she had one hair kind of just like <laughs> darting out of one of the nips. <laughs> a skew. <laughs> like, it's, just, it was, it's just so like, God, what a mess. One hair askew. Is she getting banged by a black guy in big, this next big one? Big black guy is... God, this uh, Helen Mirren, uh, before she got the good roles, had to do some stuff in Hollywood, huh? She earned her keep. <laughs> now, isn't she now a dame? <laughs> is she a dame? Is she a dame like Julie... Uh, what a Julie now? Julie's yes. a good name. Dame. Oh, Judy something. Dench? Dench. What is that? Oh, my God. Yeah, Danny, what's this one? This is called Shadow Boxer. It's before she got all those good roles. This is back in 2005. <laughs> so, wow, who's 2005, that? she was still fucking... Uh, Cuba. Doing porno rolls like that? Cuba Gooding's about to bang her? <laughs> it kind of does look like that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, she um, she had to earn her keep for many years, <laughs> it seems. Mm. You guys want a Craigslist update? Yeah, I'm looking at that right oh, now. Oh, that creep. Yeah. What is this? I didn't know you had coffee. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> All right. Hello again. He just says anything. <laughs> I didn't know you had coffee. He stops and he his body doesn't move when he talks. <laughs> yeah. It's just like a, it's like a fucking building just talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh Christ! Yeah, I, I never noticed that, but yeah, he just stops dead in his tracks, yeah. talks, uh, moves on, uh, <laughs> he fucking lurches it out, and then moves on, and he moves again. <laughs> Where's this coffee from, though? Uh, no, it's it's your coffee, but I just like got a cup out of the kitchen with the top. With the thing? Yeah, instead of walking the 10 miles down the hall to get your cup <laughs> 10 miles back, fill it, and then 10 miles to bring it back to you. That is far. These sure hallways is. are ridiculously long. Yeah. We talked about that all last week, obviously. Yeah, so but... I'm working on my time management. <laughs> yeah, you got to figure out when you can go for stuff. <laughs> time management, huh? <laughs> all right, Kenny, thank you. Uh, all right, we got to go back to the phones. We're getting to the, the, an update on the Craigslist killer. But... From Neptune is saying, and there's a handling fee with that, OP. I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. he, he charged you for wear on shoe leather. <laughs> yeah, he's probably got one of those, like, uh, those uh, things that you put on to see how far you've been walking throughout the day. <laughs> and, oh, and he charges you per step. A pedometer. A pedo. Uh, oh, <laughs> no, no, Uncle Paul, not that. A pedometer? <laughs> a pedometer. <laughs> there. Uh, <laughs> Godfather Don, the trucker. You, you, ah. You're upgrading your name, Don. No. <laughs> All right, then All right. it's a different one. All right. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a different guy. Listen, okay. I was dating this chick. She's pretty hot. So we go back to my place. I'm laying down on my back, and she's straddling on top of me. So I go to take her bra off. I take her bra off, but all of a sudden she rings forward. I tip her like that. Mozzarella hanging in the deli. Oh, they were fucking Mozzarella. <laughs> That's horrible. horrible. All hell broke loose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. all hell broke loose right <laughs> there. Rich from uh, Orlando's got a, a really good one. I've noticed this for many, many years. Uh, hello, Rich. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were reading it from somewhere else. No. <laughs> hello, Rich. Hey, what's up, Ant? Hi, sir. The uh, the Godfather is like my favorite movie of all time. Yeah. But it fucking kills me every time uh, Michael Corleone takes Apollonia's shirt off. I just got those awful, disgusting looking tits. Apollonia's tits are so bad. They're nice. They're just weird looking. They're low. so oh, they're weird looking. Oh, the, the nipples are just really light and odd, but the tits themselves are fine. No, they're uh, kind of like, it, it, they're almost cockeyed, almost oh, cross eyed nips. Worst young movie tits ever. I yeah, because like, you were real psyched when she starts taking that top off. You're like, oh my god, this chick's hot, and you're gonna see her fucking. You know, I don't remember. Let her get blown up in the car inadvertently because she had horrible tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at oh, look at them. Oh my god! Come on, that's fucking bizarre. They were still growing. There's a problem there. I'll tell you what it is. Her torso is too wide for those tits. Yeah, she needs uh, better tits. <laughs> yeah, her, her, yeah, you're right, Jimmy. Tits. <laughs> Punch it out, boys. Thank you. Yeah, very if, good, Rich. Uh, if her torso was like uh, leaner, then they would be thinner. Beautiful. Yeah, they're weird. They're too like the nips are way in there. They're they're almost cockeyed. You know what? Now the more I look at them, though, they're not that. Bad. They're not bad at all. <laughs> I, I think the guy, it's more the nipple color. And she's got those transparent ones that Op was just talking about. They're kind of very similar to the color of the skin. Yeah. Which is really... I bet she had a big fucking hairy mess. Yeah. I don't know any girl like that. <laughs> Father. Yeah, he's all mad. Pretend the devil himself. No. 
can, can we see what time does to a broad like Apollonia? Is there like a, a yeah, recent picture? Right wow. Oh, I, I, yes. Maybe we shouldn't do that. Let's see what a that, few, depress the few out spins out around the old star we call the sun. Let's see what that did. What's her? What, uh, ha what happened? Oh, that's her right there. Yeah, keep that top on. How old is she, Dan? This is uh, three years uh, after The Godfather. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. What, what, how old is she now? I mean, what's I'll her acting resume? I'll have to look. Well, when yes. did The Godfather come out? 71. 71? 71? Yeah. Oh, I was wow. going to go with 70. Oh. So if she's 20. Or is it 72? Ah, yeah, there's a little right. daughter. Oh, I see. It's hey. Hey. Oh, Uncle Paul. There's a tiny little daughter. It is. <laughs> Who came to work uh, today? Bring your daughter to work day today. So, um, what the hell are they going to learn? <laughs> so, they, so, yeah, let me bring up some big, huge muffs on Mr. Skin so for, for <laughs> yeah. all to see. <laughs> I like how the monitors are. That's all right. You're you're hiding it, Danny. What What is that? Why, I that's wish her, I would have known. That's her hiney. Is that her ass? It, that's yeah. Apollonia's hiney. It looks a little flat. She's a well, that's dis not bad. She's a disaster. The left cheek is spankable. The right cheek had a steamroller run over it. It's an uneven ass. I think she's attractive, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> I like half of her ass, Sam. The other half is bulbous and plump. It looks sick. <laughs> I love a flat hiney. Some Simon Simonetta Stefanelli. Yeah. Oh, she got a big hairy bush. Yeah. <laughs> Come awful. on. Awful. Big hairy Italian bush. A twat has fucking ravens living in it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh yeah, it looks like her acting career ended it back in 1992. Ooh. 92. Yeah. Long, uh, 20 years though. Oh. Yeah, she didn't do so much though. Is Maybe. she dead? I, I, that's what I'm thinking. Maybe her. Take life a look ended up top. See if she's still alive. No, she's still good. Still alive. What? Still alive. Weird what? tits and she's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> Weird tits. <laughs> she's uh, she's fifty four. Fifty four. That oh, means yeah. she was a young girl in that movie. She's probably eighteen. I thought oh. she was. Wait, so yeah. If she was twenty, that would be fifty one. Well, that'd be forty nine, fifty eight. What, what we She's had? how old? Oh. Fifty four. Wait, was she twenty seven when that movie was made? So been? she was about sixteen or seventeen. No, twenty seven. <laughs> What have we got here? <laughs> well, hello. Let's bring your daughter to work day, is it? Oh, what? what What are you doing? I, I'm just trying to make some copies here in the copy room, and you're... Well, hello. <laughs> Hang on, that's... Yeah, so, oh. This guy, he couldn't wait around. Banged a chick with stretch marks all over her tits. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Some uh yeah, some chicks with uh barely any titties got like stretch marks on them. Wow, yeah. She was about seventeen Weird. in the Godfather. Seventeen uh, she was in that? Well I'm sure well seventeen, eighteen, whatever the legal she, yeah. yeah. she might be doing a Hollywood age thing though. That's true. They all dropped that. Yeah, age she doesn't down. she hasn't ba she's basically done like nothing since the seventies. Nothing. She's, yeah, she did like one, two, three, four. She five, just six, specialized in showing her tits yeah. and then blowing up in cars. Yeah. Yeah. Seven, <laughs> kind of niche. <laughs> yeah. She started the Pan Am Lockerbie movie. Uh <laughs> anytime there was an explosion, she was hired. <laughs> Being blown up. Specialties. Uh, I can yell out date of the week in the wrong order. All right, well, if we need that, we'll call you. All right, here's the script. Sunday, Wednesday, Monday, Friday. No, no, we need you to do it in the right order. A Tuesday, Friday, Monday. Okay. All right, we'll call you. <laughs> That's it. Go pull the car around. Fabrizio. What was that guy's name? Uh, uh, Fabrizio. Fabrizio, yeah. Fabrizio. Let's go to Matt in Westchester. Matt. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, hey there, there, Matt. Good evening. Hey. Listen, I was with this chick, okay, <laughs> and she's so scared to show me her tits. Finally, I got them out, and her areolas, they looked like they were dripping. <laughs> oh, they were, shit. They were, they, it looked like someone took wax and dripped it, and that was her areola. <laughs> wow. On, on both of her tits. It was disgusting. I've never heard of that one before. It wouldn't bother yeah. me a bit. You know, I could, and I, I, boy, do I hate uh, uh, taking this side, but um, you got to wonder, though, there's probably many instances where uh, ladies uh, pull the old pants down and, you know, the mystery of the hog. But what, what the fuck is she going to see when the old hog comes out, oh, you know? We, we should play mystery of the hog today. Mystery of the hog. <laughs> Women? Yeah, call, play... call up, ladies. Tell us about your, your, your fucking hog horror stories. Yeah, mystery of the hog. Yeah. yeah. When, when perhaps you were in bed first time, very excited, uh, you know how that is, and then and then the pants came came down, and you went, oh shit, <laughs> either really small or just fucking freaky. You didn't expect something. Maybe the first time you saw an uncircumcised one, it was like, ah. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> and you realize it smelled like the top of your grandfather's sweating bald head. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, new bit, Mystery of the Hog. Mystery of the Hog. Nice. But they're visual creatures. <laughs> Women are vi- no, aren't aren't visual creatures. <laughs> oh, they, Jesus Christ. <laughs> There's one. <laughs> Mark that motherfucker. Oh, there goes Apollonia. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Brain's still warming up at freaking 640. Well, no, women will do it. I'm women, usually solid by now. They do say that uh, the <laughs> cock is sometimes a mess. Yeah, Fucking, yeah. They, all say they, they always say yeah. that they're not visual creatures, that we are the visual creatures. Yeah. And they're like, no, we like to sit No, this got to be nightmares. Sure. Got to be nightmares where a chick fucking, you know, sees that hog for the first time and goes like, oh, God, what's going on there? Maybe it's bent. Yeah. <laughs> you got to fucking. <laughs> I've been with girls before and they're like, oh, my God, I thought it was only going to be average. How am I going to fuck that big, delicious thing? <laughs> oh, oh my God. Well, I need to be frightened, yeah. honey. Jimmy, stop reading my mind. <laughs> Sitting there. I know. And they're really looking through a magnifying glass. <laughs> hey, God. Highlights magazine under it. All right. God bless the women. They're calling. We're going to get to right. them in a second. Uh, uh, first, Joe in Jersey to wrap up the other side of this. Uh, Joe. Hey, how you doing? Hey, Joe. Hey. Hey, yo. <laughs> yes, you're on the air. Please. Hey, I, uh, I had a girlfriend. I uh, it took a long time to get into her pants, but to make a long story short, I had her in my room. I had the mood set. It was a double whammy. I got her shirt off. I got her bra off. The tits were like beanbags. They felt like squishy <laughs> beanbags in my hand. Oh, Imme- oh, no. Immediate softy. But... <laughs> You should have played tic tac toe in the yard with them. You remember that game? <laughs> you ever you ever squeeze a boob where your fingers touch? Oh, it was, it was almost like that, and, and like I said, it immediately flaccid. You were the so, worst. The worst is when you fool around. Right. All right, all right. Sorry, let's go show. Sorry, I figured Joe. I'd get down to the bottom, and maybe things would get better. And this is when things turn ugly. I got the pants down. I got the air. I got the fingers in there. I opened up a can of worms I didn't want to. The whole room filled with a stink that made me actually throw up in the bed. All right. You didn't throw up in the bed. It, was, it nice. was that bad. Jimmy, yeah. have you ever been with a girl that has that? Yes, I have. This um, guy isn't lying. I, I, I mean, another, <laughs> another. That's not real. Uh, what are those things? Yeah, those are like I, some weird nips oh, on. Uh, her tits are wearing retard, retard propeller hats. <laughs> <laughs> those are fucking horrible. Her nips. <laughs> It yeah. was bad. Well, Joe's got to be hung up on. Yeah, right. I, I, we you, like you, you Joe. Are, <laughs> you are probably you have the worst timing of a caller ever, ever. He sounds like he's from Philly. I put my fingers in there. I know what happened. It like a cheesesteak on my end. <laughs> All right, Joe, we got you. Awful pussy. Have you had a smell? <laughs> have you had a smelly girl? I'm not talking about a little like a little something going on. I'm yeah. talking about it is horrendous. A girl I worked with many many years ago. We were doing inventory at a retail store, and she came over. And she had had stockings on all day and a hairy <laughs> puss. Wow. And her breath was horrible. It tasted like, I smelled like a, a, a kernel of corn in the pit of her stomach. And then I fucking <laughs> ate her box. And it was fucking, I went to like lick it and I went. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I went down in her anyway and I fucking ate it anyway. It was horrendous. <laughs> horrendous. Sometimes you can't tell until you break the seal. <laughs> you know, when you go down and give that first little, you know. And then it breaks the seal and goes like, oh, fucking oh, what, what happened? And then your acting skills have to come into play. <laughs> yes. Then you decide you need to do something different. Yeah. <laughs> That's when you know uh, that you could act. Could you Could you roll over? I want something that smells a little better. <laughs> yeah. Like your feet. <laughs> what the fuck's wrong with us today? I don't know. This is terrible. Let's like let's get some of the ladies' point of view on uh, right. on this though. We're talking about the mystery of the hog. <laughs> All right, uh, we talked about the mystery of the tits. The the does that, what was it called? The fucking oh, uh, world of hurt. No, no shit, uh, now I forgot. Uh, what is, what's the term? I, I want to remember that one. I came up with it on the yes. Um, gotta write unleashing that down. a uh, what what the fuck was it? <laughs> We used now it we five can't. times. God damn, we are fucking horrid here. I finally made Anthony laugh. What all was it? hell breaks loose. Oh, yeah, there yeah, it is. Yeah. Thank you from Neptune. <laughs> all hell breaks Thank loose. you from Neptune. All right, we get to the uh, lady side now. Ladies, if you're on hold, bear with us because we don't get yes. a lot of you calling. <laughs> we'll go to Lynn first. <laughs> Lynn in Pennsylvania. Hi, Mystery of the Hog. Mystery of the Hog. Many, yes. many years ago, many, many years ago, I had um, met a guy and I was quite attracted to him. I had um, gone out. Um, once on the second date, I decided that um, I was attracted to him, sexually attracted to him, and I wanted to do him. Yeah. So as we're kissing and feeling around, everything's getting you know, a little bit hot and heavy, we start taking our clothes off. 
Well, when he pulled down his pants, I saw the biggest, the, the cock wasn't even black anymore. It was beyond black. It was like purple cock that I had ever seen in my life. It was big. I was like, whoa. Wait, it was, it was big in a good way? Oh, it was fucking ginormous. Wow. And I said, dude. Wait, wait, how, you know. Because we're all sitting I'm here like, fuck what? Fuck what is I'm a giant? Hold on. Oh, it's the phone dry. Oh, dude, dude. Like five inches? You can't even imagine <laughs> but how, the size of this cock. All wow. right. But tell us, like, is it uh, an entire arm? Is it a fucking well, Gatorade dude, bottle? Was, yeah, dude. It was like an entire arm, okay? What like nationality was he? A toddler arm. Excuse me? What nationality was he? I just told you it was a purple Cock. Oh, he was, was black? black. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It was the biggest wow. cock I'd ever seen in my life. So he said, you think you can take all that? Mm. I was like, dude, you're not even fucking sticking that fucking cock in me. I was like, I've already had my fucking tonsils out. Did you suck he it? Said, well, just the tip ah, just for a little while. Just I the said, tip. He put Bob's Ke- Bob Kelly's CD in her vagina. <laughs> yeah, you better know it. So he said, well, will you suck it? I said, dude, the best thing I can fucking do is give you a handy. I said, and that is fucking it. So what happened with the sexy so, talk like this back and forth? <laughs> I know. I was oh, like, dude, God. I'll suck it for... <laughs> you called him dude? I'm oh, coming. <laughs> dude, <laughs> I'll suck it, dude. I think he was kind of getting turned on by the whole thing. How did yeah. you get, and I, at I, that point, I was getting a little frightened terrible. because he definitely That's wanted to touch me in a Jesus. big fucking way. Yeah. So he said, how about taking it in the ass? Jesus. And I said, if you stuck your dick in me, it would come out of my fucking ass, okay? I said, I'm not in a lot She's like Denise I'm Leary. I, I, I'm not the least bit turned on by I'm actually talk. plumping up. Even though the way she's just describing it is bad, I like the fact that she saw a big fucking cock. Did you, did you like it when you saw it? Oh, not well. At first, it kind of like it was. It was really weird. It was like almost like, um, ooh, my adrenaline was pumping, and I was kind of like excited because I'd only seen something that big, like in magazines. <laughs> magazines <laughs> so, sounds like Patty. So you gave him a handy. <laughs> um, no, he was definitely not interested in a handy. Oh, I was Good just, for him. Um, I was just trying to set up a. So he an wanted okay to know if I would watch him. Jack says, off. I'll just talk over because like her <laughs> yeah. penis was. Uh, his Her penis. penis. <laughs> I know. I, I hear you. I'm, <laughs> I'm with you. His penis is so big, and she said about a handy. So I'm thinking she did it like you're trying to pick teams for a pickup baseball game. <laughs> oh yeah, well, where you do that, you know and then you get the hand over the head. <laughs> do, do you know? Um, women never admit. To, <laughs> oh my god! Talk to anybody just, that wants to this take that on. Fucking. <laughs> can they hear us or no? They have. Lynn, can is you there hear a us? phone problem? Lynn, can you it, hear? Can you hear us? Yes, I can hear you very well. And is there a delay? No, not at all. Hey, uh, okay. then you're just delay. fucking stupid well, and on. rude. <laughs> when, when I say something, when I, when I say um, now, I want you to say hi, just to see if there's a delay, okay? Okay. Now. Hi. Now. Hi. Now. I think you're fucking. No, I'm actually not. I think it seems like there's a little bit of a delay. I think there might be a back. slight delay. The second you hear hi, the second you hear it, say hi back, okay? Hi. Okay. Hi. 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 Hi, hi. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a little there's bit of a, a delay. Slight delay. Half a second delay. Which would... You know what? I have to go, guys. I have to go and say that. Thank God. God. She was sexy, though. Uh, I, I liked her story. Vanessa, North Carolina. She obviously hi. doesn't have to go and uh, call her father. <laughs> <laughs> no Father's Day for you. No. That's hilarious. Well, she does. They probably just, they were estranged for 25 years, just made up. <laughs> Go ahead, sorry. Go ahead, Vanessa. Oh, okay. I was, uh, I was on business in Cincinnati, and uh, one weekend, it was Biker Week, so there were a lot of hot guys in town. Uh, me and my girlfriend were at the bar at the hotel, and a bunch of them came over, and there was this really good-looking guy. He looked like uh, Ian McShellen from Ted Wood uh, or McShane. Wow. Yeah, he was, he, I mean, he had an attitude, but, uh, you know, coming from New York, I was like, what the hell is wrong with you? And he kind of he cleared up, so I took him back to my hotel room. And I was all into this. I mean, I like the biker dudes, but um, he put, he dropped his drawers, and I got on my knees and I looked down. And I don't want to discriminate against the cock because I mean, you know, all cocks are beautiful. But um, 
I swear to God, this one was the size of a Tootsie Roll. Oh, and no. Was it, the, was, it the same, uh, was it the same shade? Yeah. <laughs> it was so small. I mean, I sucked on it for a little bit, but, uh, I mean, it didn't get no bigger than a baby's. Uh, penis. Oh, oh my God! How fucking oh, Uncle Paul! <laughs> oh, how embarrassing! Um, oh, he's a biker. I, he's fucking. He's I, tired of people laughing at him. Yeah. Yeah. I tried. I tried to hold back the laughter, so I just. I. I told him. I said, um, you know, what am I supposed to do with that? That's, oh, you know. <laughs> good line. Yeah, you should. You should have just flicked it. That'll boost his I, confidence. I'm. So, I'm surprised <laughs> they didn't murder you. Yeah, he probably did crank him and hit him with a fucking chain. <laughs> you know, yeah, I know. <laughs> You know, given the fact. So I just laid on the couch and started playing with myself. And I was like, well, maybe you could do something with it and make it grow. Yeah. You know, and uh, and then I think he got embarrassed and we went back downstairs. And then I. Uh, do you think he got embarrassed? <laughs> How perceptive of you. What, what, what told you he was embarrassed? The guy with the teardrop tattoo when he just started weeping openly and yelling at God? <laughs> well, we went back downstairs and he was gone. He was gone. And then I started asking all his friends. I'm like, I'm like, oh, my God. I never, th- you know, anybody who says size doesn't matter has never seen one that Oh, so now you had to tell all his friends that he had a small dick? <laughs> oh, shit. That's why he, <laughs> you're one of those. Great. That's why, he, that's why he rode a motorcycle. He just wanted women for once to go, hey, that's a great hog. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, by the way, one of the sexiest things I ever heard a girl say, and I had forgotten about this, is a girl, I was talking, women will never admit to liking big cocks. Mm-hmm. I was with this girl in time, and, um. We were fooling around and we were just because she was admitting that she liked really big cocks. Like, I knew my cock was fine, but it was nowhere near the fucking league of what, what she, she wanted. Was. No, of course not. <laughs> we didn't see each other very long. <laughs> but it was very sexy because she knew I was turned on, so she's blowing me. And I'm like, yeah, a lot of girls just won't admit. A lot of girls say that uh, size doesn't matter. And she pulled my dick out of her mouth and she goes, any girl that says size doesn't matter has never had big. And then she stuck it back in her mouth. Holy shit! And before it before it was back down to my balls, I went <laughs> and I shit. <laughs> I was so angry at her. I gave her some chin discipline. <laughs> All right, Vanessa, thank you. All right, thanks. I love you guys. Bye. Oh, the mystery of the the cock. Uh, I guess we could do. <laughs> oh yeah, I love these stories. We could do one more. We got sure. We got Allison in Jersey. Allison. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I um I just want to start by saying I'm sorry I haven't followed up with any more chunky radio stories. Oh, you want oh, yeah. to call chunky, okay? <laughs> oh, oh, you know what? Right. Yeah. What day is it? Uh, today's oh, yes, Thursday. Thursday. All right. All right. We got to be good for a few more days, but I could say this much: uh, the the ratings came out for uh, the station we just left. Yeah. <laughs> what? Well, well, really? You would think if you had ten thousand songs in a row without commercials, that would uh, listen. That you would have a nice big huge spike in the in the trend. Oh, uh, oh no, oh, a little too oh. inside. But some people are enjoying that. Wah, nah, wah, wah, nah, wah. They got rid of us for a pop format, ten thousand songs in a row, and uh, the first little ratings period. Not so good. Not so good. Ah, God love them, Allison. Uh, what do you got on the cock? Um. <laughs> Speaking of letdowns, uh, I got hooked up with a friend of mine's best friend, and she was like, he's really hot, so on and so forth. So finally, I met up with him, like, you know, gave him the time of day, and he... Wait, he, Allison, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Was his best friend a guy, or was that was his dog? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Very nice. I'm like, okay. uh, this is bass, and that was like McGruff. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, Oh, well, I was evil. Um, yeah. Anyway, so yeah. I met up with him, and we gone out a few times, and he was, he was really, really hot. And so I finally kind of, you know, got into bed with him, mm. and he was. I, the lights were off, and I was searching around. His pants were off, and I couldn't, I couldn't find anything to work with. So I was like, would you mind turning the lights on? He was like, why? I was like, because I can't. I've got nothing. I have no idea what's going on down there. And you guys are talking about Big Bush. Literally, I, I had no idea. It was a fucking jungle. Oh, my God. You couldn't find his dick? No, nothing. I have no idea where. I didn't know what to do. What did he say horrible. after your encouraging words? <laughs> <laughs> hey, can, can, we get a, can we get a call out a search party? I'm having yes. trouble locating your cock. <laughs> Well, he played it off like I was the idiot. He was like, have you ever done this before? I was like, yeah, but not with anything this 
fucking elusive. Mm. So what happened? Did you find it? Was it just a small penis? Obviously. Uh, <laughs> oh, a chick. Was, I, I don't know. The previous woman was talking about a tootsie roll. That would be generous. Really? really? Oh, Jesus. man. Some guys are cursed with the small cock. I, I kind of felt bad, but at the same time, I was like, punch you know up what? tiny cocks, uh, <laughs> Danny. Punch up tiny cocks on the fucking Google, and let's see if we can find what this woman's talking about. <laughs> oh no! I love small penis <laughs> pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how do they... ah, that's very visual, but man, that's fucking just... That how couldn't they, be real. How do they play along at home there, Danny? Well, if you'd like to <laughs> find this one I'm looking at right now, uh, go to Google Images, type in Tiny Cox. Make sure, uh, your, make sure, uh, make that, sure your yeah. search preferences are set to um, fucking kill and not stun. Yeah, <laughs> take, take Safe Search completely yeah. off if yeah, Safe yeah. Search is on. Oh, take it off, and um, it will be the second thing to come up. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. So otherwise, you just have a bunch of Asian people popping up. <laughs> oh. Those type of nothing. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> oh, the tiny cock pictures tiny, are hilarious. Tiny cock. This one's called Boy Clit. <laughs> Boy Clit. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. That is terrible. Uh, well, Allison, so Man. how did it end? Did you did you do anything with that tiny cock? <laughs> how did it end? I I stopped. I took a step back and I said, look. You need to do women a favor and stop being so cocky. Because, and I didn't mean to do it, but I yeah. said, stop being so cocky, but you've got nothing to work with here. And he was just kind of like, oh, well, I'll go then. I was like, yeah, maybe you should. I'm sorry. We can't even concentrate. Your We're call. looking at what looks like a fucking a nose and a chin, but it's apparently it's genitals. This could be the greatest Google image search ever. It, this, so what else is uh, something else? It's Kevin from Connecticut. He writes, uh, pop in micro penis too. <laughs> micro penis? Uh, yeah, tiny cocks and micro penis in the Google <laughs> image search. <laughs> we'll give you laughter for the next hour. <laughs> God damn it. You know, some people just are fucked. <laughs> that sucks. That really does have to fucking uh, really suck. Oh, God. That guy's got an innie penis. Somebody uh, we know has one kind of like that. Who? Oh. Who might be in competitive eating. <laughs> oh, Half from no. Anaki? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Does he have one of those? Uh, it's, it's, it goes in more. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God damn. It's a king patch penis. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, oh, fuck. <laughs> Thank you, Allison. Yeah. I think what's worse, this Allison? guy's... She's gone. Is oh, she gone? We, we lost her. All right. We were too busy, like, not concentrating looking on our phone at, call. We weren't paying attention to her anymore. We were looking at little tiny penises. <laughs> Teeny peeny. <laughs> Let's take our first yeah. break. Yeah. Uh, we'll do the Craigslist <laughs> killer update after the break. <laughs> what we got? Which one? <laughs> oh, my God. What is that? Oh, they're all so good. <laughs> we have a yeah. Billy Bob Thornton update. Remember? We do. Yeah, from his, uh, his interview in Canada where he came across like a fucking... Idiot. A douchebag. Oh, He's explaining himself on Jimmy Kimmel. We got the audio. Is he? And uh, Shepard Smith cursing. Shepard Smith ag again? We got a, a... Shep is uh, horrible with that. Shep rules. Oh, uh, oh. Fight breaks out over bingo game at Senior Center. Nice. So Looking lots old, of stuff to do. bags. And I think <laughs> when we get back, we should discuss the latest um, video I, uh, I put up from oh, our Real Rock I have TV not seen show. it yet. Whoa, we've, been, we've, we've been doing one a day, one video a day. Uh, these videos are about 11 years old, I've, I finally figured out. Oh, Uncle Paul. Uh, <laughs> uh, Not on that one, forget it. I, I don't remember doing these videos. Ants doesn't remember doing these videos. And the one I put up yesterday got, got the people at Talking Jimmy, and we'll debut it for you next, Jimmy, to get your I've comments. I've not seen it. You haven't seen it? I honestly have not. All right, we'll do that next. Opie and Anthony.